हेलो 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 एंड अ वेरी वॉम वेलकम टू स्पोर्ट्स लूमोस 50 ग्रेटेस्ट ओलंपिक मोमेंट्स फॉर इंडिया आई एम सिद्धार्थ विश्वनाथन एडिटर इन चीफ ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स लूमो डॉट कॉम एंड इन द स्पेशल एपिसोड टुडे आई विल बी फोकसिंग अपॉन बेरिस्ट मार्जिन्स एंड अ वॉल्ट ऑफ डेथ दैट वॉज नीडेड टू सिक्योर अ मेडल hailing from the northeast of india meant that already you were at an advantage or a disadvantage you may say lack of infrastructure maybe lack of recognition but one who overcomes them all and establishes themselves on the big stage makes them superhuman in a way this is the story of deepa karmakar and how she nearly came close to winning a medal in a sport which is not considered fancy in india deepa karmakar and her vault of death in 2016 is legendary in so many ways this is the story of how she came so close to achieving a historic medal in rio folks gymnastics in india has not gotten that much amount of recognition or respect it was primarily viewed as an event that used to be played out in the circuses or it would just be used for recreational fun it was viewed more as a viewing spectacle it wasn't meant to be played out deepa karmaka defied all that born in agartala deepa slowly made headways into the world of gymnastics aided by her coach biseshwar nandi the duo of biseshwar nandi and deepa karmakar would script lot of gymnastic history in years to come she first started winning gymnastic competitions in the northeast finals for many years the jalpaiguri gymnastics international event was a stage where deepa karmaka dominated a lot of times however deepa karmaka's major break came in the 2011 nationals when she swept the gold in all the four disciplines floor balance beams uneven bars the vault she slowly became known for her vault that 2011 performance in the nationals was what springboarded deepa karmakar into the national consciousness a superb performance in the 2014 commonwealth games in glasgow saw her securing a bronze medal but in that event the world saw deepa karmakar unveiling the produnova vault it is also called the death vault what is the produnova the produnova was named after yelena produnova of russia it was a vault by which you had to get on the horse do a double somersault and land with your feet intact on the ground the move is very very difficult to execute and is also very dangerous because in the prodinova vault the chances of suffering a career threatening neck injury are high the prodinova vault is often called the death vault and there have been calls in the gymnastics world to ban the sport yet deepa karmakar is one of the only five gymnasts in the whole world to have ever successfully completed the prodino that put her in a very good frame of mind heading into rio 2016 as she had become the first indian to win a bronze medal in gymnastics in the commonwealth history was on the side remember folks 
even simon biles the greatest gymnast in the in the history of the sport has not attempted the prodinova vault deepa wanted to risk it all she finished in the top 8 and she was almost on the cusp of glory after she had reached the final round deepa proceeded to do the prodinova but her landing on the second attempt was not that comfortable she ended with a score of 15 the average but she could not win the bronze the margin by which she missed the bronze was 0.15 0.15 points that was the margin of defeat for deepa karmakar despite executing the prodinova although not perfectly but almost 90% correct deepa karmakar could not do it far from being disappointed the national media hailed her as a hero accolades poured in she won the rajiv gandhi khel ratna deepa karmakar had given aspiring gymnasts in india tremendous confidence in expressing themselves in the last couple of years deepa karmakar has been troubled by a chronic knee injury which is common place for all gymnasts but her feats in rio were simply unbelievable medal or no medal deepa karmakar made the world and india proud with such a stirring display on debut that is all in this special episode folks thank you so much for joining us on this i will be back with more anecdotes in the upcoming dates in the next episode i will be focusing upon another near miss this time it was 32 years before in 1984 deepa missed the bronze by 0.15 this athlete missed the bronze by 1 by 100% press the subscribe button tap the bell icon like comment and share folks you will get to know all these interesting anecdotes and historical snippets of india's glorious representation in the olympics only on sportslumo.com take care stay safe bye bye